everybody. Like, when you come to a place like this, everybody's a, fine, a, a fan of Big Mike, man. What is that like? That's Kyrie Irving right there. Hey, I'm just, um, I'm just passing through, brother. I'm enjoying life as it is. I heard you had a special. Was that your family? You had somebody with you today? Let's get you in. Let's get you I'm Terrell. Nice to meet you. I'm Alon Tyson. Tyson, pleasure to meet you. You're here with Pops today. Did he give you any kind of prep on how to walk the red carpet? <laughs> in the warning? No, no, no. We just go. <laughs> Are you seeing that everybody's, like, tripping out when they see Mike? Are you seeing the reaction? Yeah. You see the reaction? Why do you say this? Everyone yeah. loves him. Everyone loves him. What is it like living? What is it like having Mike as a pops, man? I mean, like. Most of the time. Like, he's, yeah, he's calm. He's a really good dad. He just takes us to the movies. He does things. He just does normal things. Yeah. Yeah, he just takes I didn't us. I not have a dad either, but um, by making a lot of mistakes, you learn how to become a dad. There's a lot of celebrities here, a lot of athletes. You've probably seen all the athletes. So what celebrities are you looking forward to? Or athletes, too? You looking forward to? I'm just enjoying my, uh, my time here. I don't look at it as anybody. I'm superior. Nobody's superior. We're all equals, and we all enjoy each other's personalities. And what brought us here really is their determination and will. And that's what we pretty much vibe off of each other. This is like my third time interviewing your dad. Every time I interview him, I get a little nervous because we used to go get a haircut. Back in the day when he was about to fight, we would close things down, get a haircut just to watch TV, to watch your, your pops fight. It was an, it was like an event, Mike, so it's an honor to talk to you, brother. Um, you're going to present her today. Who are you presenting for today? I have no idea. Do you know? What, what you're presenting for? No. I, we have no clue who this came. We're hoping for the <laughs> best. <laughs> you just going on stage. Get together. I, I wing it a lot of times. I just wing it. He's like, I don't even. I'm a great winger. I'm a great winger. I want to know this. That's so funny. He's like, I don't know. Do you know? Mike, uh, who throws the best after parties, athletes or celebrities? Listen. Because, no, I'm just thinking that I, who's doing better than mine. But then, I, hey, listen, I, I'm going to say nothing. Who do you think Bobby Brown? Brown? Bobby Brown was up there with you. Bobby Brown is very big in that department of life, yeah. Listen, your dad is hip to pop culture, but just in case, I want you to come a little closer to help him out with this one, okay? We're doing hot, we're doing hot day hot takes, okay, Mike? So two concerts this summer, big concerts. If you can go to only one, which one would you go to, Beyonce or Taylor Swift? Beyonce. <laughs> See, like, Dad, you better say Beyonce. <laughs> Okay, Pops, one more. Uh, two movies, two big movies coming out this year, Oppenheimer and Barbie. Which one are we going to go see? Okay. Uh, Oppenheimer, so World War II. Nuclear bomb. Yeah, we'll see that. Barbie. Barbie, yeah. Are you, are you a big Barbie fan? Yeah, I love Barbie. I want to ask you, ask you this question. We have a Barbie picture here. Mike, your daughter, she's beautiful. Here are the three Barbies that we have. We have stereotypical Barbie. That's her name. not making it up. We got President Barbie and Weird Barbie. How, which one is your daughter? Absolutely, right here. Presidential Barbie. Right here. Yes, that's her.